Internet banking could become much more secure. Fingerprint identification is just one of the measures being considered to crack down on fraud. Australians love online banking more than most others in the world. Banks love it too because it's cheaper to administer. The trouble is traditional security isn't keeping the hackers out. Now we're looking at going to the next level for our personal customers and so we're looking at a range of options. Westpac says that could be fingerprint identification or other secondary forms of protection. We just have to look at what is uh, the most secure and what is also convenient and what also meets privacy and those other types of standards. Bendigo Bank already offers a token system for electronic banking Banking, a safety precaution other banks are most likely to adopt. That means to bank online you have to enter your password along with a special secure number that could be sent to a small device or as an SMS to your phone. The internet industry says that will offer peace of mind to the 10 million Australians who go online each month. Much harder for fraudsters to hack into your computer and know what you're doing if it's a separate device like a token or a mobile phone almost uh, impossible for someone to replicate that, so much more secure. Online banking transactions aren't the only concern. Credit cards remain the major fraud issue for banks, and they're also now getting the security spotlight. ANZ is starting to offer smart cards which provide better protection. The sooner we can move the whole industry in Australia to, uh, to, towards uh, smart cards, the safer credit card transactions will be. New online security systems could be trialled within 18 months. Eddie Meyer, 10 News.